Steak is any cross-cut slab of meat, usually beef, that is between 1 to 2 inches thick that is meant to be cooked with relatively high heat quickly. It is considered to be one of the most popular and most American meals to have, not to mention one of the tastiest when it is cooked perfectly, whether you like it well done or rare, but we all know that rare is really the only way to go when it comes to steak. Anyway, moving on. Steak is mainly composed of water, which we all know is H2O, and protein, which is composed of carbon, nitrogen, and oxygen, and makes up approximately 20% of all animal muscle. But this video is titled The Chemistry of Steak, so what does chemistry have to do with one of America's favorite foods to have? The process of cooking steak happens through the Maillard reaction, which is a chemical reaction where sugars and amino acids in the meat react to heat and create new and flavorful compounds. When the meat is cooked, the outside temperature becomes hotter than the inside, which triggers the reaction. Iron atoms begin to lose an electron, which causes the gradual color change in the meat. There are protein molecules in the meat that are bonded in coils, and when heat is applied, those bonds begin to break and the coils begin to unwind. Most of the water content in the muscle fibers then leak out, and reactive carbonyl groups of the sugars react with the nucleophilic amino acids, which then produces glycosylamine and water. So next time you're going to cook yourself and maybe your loved ones a big slab of wonderfulness, you will know what is happening when your meat is sizzling in your pan. For more information on the Maillard reaction and the chemistry of steak, visit www.chemistryislife.com. Thank you for watching!